Good morning, this is David with Weathermatic Tech Services. This morning I wanted to take a moment to cover with you how to do a manual run operation from the new SmartLink remote app. All right, so first let's begin by opening the SmartLink remote control. And based on our geographical location, it is gonna bring us to the site nearest to us. So at this point, bringing up to my test site, I've got some alarms here that I could check out if necessary, but uh, I'm not going to do that. I'm just going right to view controllers. Here's my controller list. I'm going to go ahead and select a controller here. Now on the system status page, I'm going to click operations. And as you can see, manual run. And at this page, I'm able to either run the zone or the program by rotating the dial around. So let's go with run zone and hit OK. So on the next page, it brings up our zone list. And if I just rotate around the dial, you'll see the four zones that I have that are active. The other four are not. So I'm just going to go ahead and select uh, drip backyard and we'll say OK. And now on this page, we'll select the duration we wish to run by simply pressing the plus sign or the negative symbol and select run. Now, as you can see, we're communicating to the panel and the solenoid shall be firing. There it goes. And so it's gonna begin counting down. The instructions complete, water's flowing. Uh, to stop that, simply press stop. Let it communicate the command back to the panel. Instruction complete, and the solenoid has stopped. And that is how you do a manual run operation from the new SmartLink remote control application. Thank you and have an awesome day.